indirect. The term indirect is often used to describe something that is not direct or immediate. In the context of language, indirect can refer to various aspects, such as indirect speech, indirect questions, and indirect objects. Let's explore each of these concepts with examples to understand their meaning and usage better. 1. Indirect speech. Indirect speech, also known as reported speech, is used when we want to convey someone else's words or thoughts without quoting them directly. In indirect speech, the tense, pronouns, and adverbs may change to match the reporting verb's tense and the speaker's perspective. Here's an example. Direct speech. I am going to the park, she said. Indirect speech. She said that she was going to the park. In this example, the direct speech is transformed into indirect speech by changing the pronoun I to she and the verb tense from present continuous, am going, to past continuous, was going. 2. Indirect questions. Indirect questions are a more polite and formal way of asking a question. Instead of using the direct question format, we use an indirect structure that often includes introductory phrases like, could you tell me, do you know, or I wonder. Here's an example. Direct question. What time is the meeting? Indirect question. Could you tell me what time the meeting is? In this example, the direct question is transformed into an indirect question by using the introductory phrase, could you tell me, and maintaining the same word order as a statement. 3. Indirect objects. In English, some verbs can take both direct and indirect objects. An indirect object is the recipient or beneficiary of the action expressed by the verb. It answers the question, to, for whom, or, to, for what. Here's an example. Direct object. She gave me a gift. Indirect object. She gave a gift to me. In this example, the direct object is, a gift, and the indirect object is, me. The verb, gave, expresses the action of giving, and the indirect object indicates the recipient of the gift. Overall, the term, indirect, in English language refers to various linguistic aspects, such as indirect speech, indirect questions, and indirect objects. Understanding these concepts helps us communicate effectively and accurately convey information in different contexts.